Hey everyone, it's Mindy from MommyMouseClubhouse.com and today I'm excited to show you around the Disneyland Hotel. This place is amazing and definitely one of my favorite hotels in Anaheim. The staff was so friendly and welcoming, the rooms were spacious and clean, and the pool area was just perfect for relaxing after a long day at the parks. If you're looking to get a great deal on a hotel stay and tickets to Disneyland, check out the description below for links to my favorite travel company, Getaway Today. Their tickets are always cheaper than buying directly from Disney and their customer service is the best. Now, make sure you are subscribed so you won't miss any Disney fun and let's get started with our tour of the Disneyland Hotel. When you arrive for your stay at the Disneyland Hotel, the first thing you will see is the lobby. There are so many cute Disney touches like teacup themed chairs. There are three towers at the Disneyland Hotel. Let's first take a look at the Fantasy Tower, which is where the main lobby and gift shops are located. This tower has a giant map of Disneyland and many other Disneyland touches that you'll enjoy. Our next stop is the Adventure Tower. There are some cute artifacts inside representing the Jungle Cruise, which is located inside Adventureland at Disneyland. This is the tower you'll want to book your room in if you want a view of the fireworks. The next tower is the Frontier Tower. There is a cool model of Big Thunder Mountain to see and you will also find the fitness center in this tower. Now let's take a tour of our room in the Fantasy Tower with a pool view. Our room had two queen beds and a magical headboard that we will talk about in just a minute. Look at these adorable decorative pillows that say, A dream is a wish your heart makes from the movie Cinderella. The headboard features a carving of Sleeping Beauty Castle and Mickey Mouse shaped fireworks in the sky. When you flip a switch on the lamp, the headboard begins to sparkle while it plays the music box version of A Dream is a Wish Your Heart Makes. There are even Mickey Mouse heads embroidered into the bedspread. Our room also had a chair, a dresser, 
TV, and a desk or vanity with another chair. Here is the area just outside the bathroom where you will find another large mirror, the coffee maker with complimentary coffee, and the closet. The bathroom has a single sink vanity with cute Mickey Mouse details and my favorite H2O bath products. There is a shower and tub combination and the toilet is in a separate room. Here is the view of the pool from our room. There are a few different dining options at the Disneyland Hotel. Goofy's Kitchen is a table service restaurant that features character meals and requires a reservation. The Coffee House is a great place to grab your caffeine fix and a light snack in the morning. At Trader Sam's, you can order your favorite drink and get the famous Dole Whip as well. We ate breakfast twice at Tangaroa Terrace, a quick service location where you can get breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Our favorite item was the Tangaroa Toast, which is a fried French toast filled with citrus cream and served with guava syrup and a side of bacon. We loved this meal so much that I made a copycat recipe the day we got home. You can find a link for that recipe in the description below. You're welcome. The pool area is amazing. There are two pools, the larger is the E-Ticket pool and the smaller is the D-Ticket pool. There is also a hot tub and our favorite part, the two water slides that look like the Disneyland monorail under a replica of the original Disneyland sign. There are two gift shops at the Disneyland Hotel, both inside the Fantasy Tower. Small World Gifts and Sundries has swimming gear and snacks.
Fantasia Shop has all kinds of Disneyland souvenirs and apparel. I contemplated buying one of the cute Disneyland suitcases on my way home. One of the perks of staying at the Disneyland Hotel is that Downtown Disney is literally a two-minute walk. Being so close to Downtown Disney opens many new dining options like Black Tap Anaheim and Wetzel's Pretzels, as well as shopping opportunities like World of Disney and the Lego Store. of the Disneyland Hotel. I really enjoyed my stay and plan to stay there again in the future. If you are looking at other hotels in the Disneyland area, make sure to check out my video reviews for Howard Johnson Anaheim, Radisson Blue, Cambria Hotel and Suites, Great Wolf Lodge, and my video highlighting eight amazing hotels within walking distance of Disneyland. If you have any questions about these properties, leave them in the comments below. See you next time.